let's go ahead. This next contest is at a hundred and twenty-five pounds. Scheduled for three five-minute rounds. Let's go ahead and welcome first out of the blue corner, Damian Martinez. Damian Martinez, a young man who I have also commentated as an amateur. A lot of guys that I've commentated on the amateur ranks uh, fighting professionally this evening. Very, very, uh, makes you feel old. Makes you feel proud as well. Damian Martinez, he was a five and three amateur making his professional debut tonight. Um, even though she's in the building, he wants her a little bit of sound bite, a little bit of footage shouting out his fiance, Marissa. He wanted to say thanks for everything, especially for being here tonight. About five foot six, normally 125 pounds. Uh, however, this was a catch weight of 122. For some reason, Kenny Sabina wanted him to come in three pounds lighter, made the weight without much issue from what I understand. There we see uh, combat guys. Oh, there's uh, there's Rudy Asidro, Ronnie Brewer in his corner as well. So a uh, uh, everybody at home getting a lot of shots of Rodney Brewer. You're welcome. Yeah, Damian Martinez. Um, he is a very very uh, high pace. He's a he he is a spur. He's a he's a uh, the firecracker, as it were. High paced fighter, little guy, a lot of action, a lot of output, a lot of intensity, a lot of energy. Very, very, he's what you call a fan favorite. Um, definitely has a, a, a style that you'll want to see. Uh, Kenny Sabino, his opponent tonight, also a, 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 a tough a tough fighter. So this should be very, very, uh, this is, this is a, uh, a, a, a good debut, good test for Damian Martin. And his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. Let's welcome in Ken Sabino. And here comes little Kenny Sabino. Uh, also, a, uh, I've commentated him for XFN as well, Very, um, as a professional as well. Also, uh, not as an amateur even, uh, for world-class combat sports. Um, so, Ken Sabino is a, uh, he's a, he's a, uh, Got a lot of gas in the tank. He's a uh, he's kind of a well-rounded fighter. Uh, got got some good tricky grappling. A lot of good uh, a lot of good submission attacks. Um, so this is a, again, again this is not what you'd call a uh, this is not what you'd call a a, a laydown debut for Daniel Martinez. I wasn't able to get any words and catch up with him before tonight's fight. Unfortunately, I uh, I, 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 I didn't know this was So. Uh, have this up-to-date record. I'm sure that Rodolfo Roman will have that, and I will appreciate that once he gets into it. Set for our fourth bout of the evening, Damian Martin making his debut against Jenny Sabina right here at Action Fight League. And here is Sabino taking the cage. Rodolfo Roman is going to get the introductions out of the way in just a moment. Cupping mark on the back. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this contest is scheduled for three five-minute rounds. Let's go ahead and welcome first out of the blue corner. This man is making his professional debut. He is a mixed martial artist who weighed in 120.2 pounds, fighting out of Borden Beach, Florida. Here is Damien Martinez. Head across the cage out of the red corner. This man is in search of his first victory, comes in with a record of no victories, five defeats. He's a boxer and a wrestler, weighed in at 122.4 pounds, fighting at a Fort Lauderdale, Florida. Here is Ken Sabino. 
And with the action begins, third man in the cage, Andy Glenn. Ken Sabino having a uh, little rough start to his career, 0 and 5. He's got a, got a real test of fun album, Damian Martinez. Uh, again, who, though making his pro debut, has, was 5-3 and three as an amateur. He is experienced. And Blake, when you look at Ken Sabino in search of his first Ooh, victory. Very he's been quick a, takedown from Martinez. He's Mart been very confident. He says that he's, he's very confident. This is it. He says that he feels that this competition here, he's going to get his first victory inside the AFL cage at the Hard Rock Live. But you got to go. You're, you feel pressured in. Five defeats hmm. as a pro. There's a lot of a lot of mental battles going into this fight for him. There is, especially especially with his size. He's not what you call a big 125er. He actually requested the catch weight for Damian Martinez to cut a little bit extra weight. Um, it, it, it's hard whenever you're that size to find fights as it is, and uh, that that could be as discouraging as the record. But that Damian Martinez here is not going to be uh, willing to just give him his first pro win. Uh, and Kid Sabino. Damian Martinez is a, a very high pressure, high action, high pace fighter, as you see here. Beautiful takedown. Some, uh, Sabino working back to his feet, though. One minute in. Sabino credits his ba wrestling background and his boxing mm -hmm. to allow him to compete at this level. Has a lot of confidence in it. His last competition goes back to Martinez working to the back already as Sabino looks to stand up. He might have been a little lazy there. Goes back to October. Martinez of last is year. tough there. Martinez is in, is in a good spot here. He's under the. He's working under the neck. He's got good back control. Ken Sabino's in big trouble right here. Uh, can't see it from this direction here. But the last time he Body competed, triangle. Body Triangle's locked in under the chin. Sabino staying calm. Martinez has three and a half minutes to work this choke here, though. And that is all that, she wrote. That's it. Rear naked choke victory. That's the same way that Sabino lost his last outing back in October. He lost it also in the first round by a rear naked choke. Yep, needs to go back to the old drawing board and solve the puzzle as it were. Damian Martinez, again, flawless, no damage. <laughs> a takedown. Make the some noise! Work, had the back. Uh, Sabino made a mistake. Too worried about getting back to his feet. Woo! Sounds going position. down. Hard and Rock Live. The back. Damian Martinez with a first round rear naked choke. One and done. So we're we are still kind of keeping an eye on the clock here. So if I can't get a rear naked choke with I'm mean, excuse me, a rear naked choke. If I can't get a post fight interview with Damian Martinez, know that I was very impressed, but not surprised. Not surprised by the finish at all. I think I will get a uh, a. Uh, and again, um, Kenny Sabino, I know he's got talent. I know he's got a lot of heart, but he needs to, needs to figure out what's missing in the game right now. All right, ladies and gentlemen. This contest comes to an end at 1 minute and 39 seconds in the first round for your winner. By way of rear naked choke submission. And now has his first mixed martial arts professional victory. Here is Damien Martinez. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to grab a word with your winner, Mr. Damien Martinez. Just a moment. Show some respect to the other corner here. As always, sportsmanship in class. Mr. Martinez, you made quick work here in your professional debut. Now, you had quite a uh, busy amateur career, as it were. Uh, transition to pro. Uh, you came out on fire early takedown. Nice and patient. Did a lot of good grappling. Took the back. And once you got there, no getting you off. Um, take a moment. Right? I think you certainly earned it. And we got to kill some time, young man. <laughs> um, I just want to say thank you to all my uh, friends and family that came out to support me tonight. I love you guys. Um, I want to give a shout out to my teams, Combat Club, Black Zillions. You guys helped me build so much. Uh, I mean, I've been training for nine years, and I just keep getting better because you guys keep putting work into me. So I appreciate you guys so much.
All right, so between amateur and your pro debut here, you got nine fights under your belt. It doesn't get much easier than that. You didn't like to take a lot of damage. I have to figure you got to get back on there as soon as possible. Do you have something coming up? You got anything you're looking for anywhere you want to get some action? Um, I was saying if it, if it went the distance or if I took any damage, I would wait till April. But uh, I didn't take any damage. I'm thinking maybe March, so we'll see. Anybody out there running a show looking for a 125-er that will deliver? His name is Damian Martinez. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together. 1-0, oh, good start to his pro career.